of that as he'll be available next week but he might not get back in and uh, here's an opportunity now for Gallagher to put this one across the face of the goal it's in the net it's 1-0 to Drada inside three minutes and it's Warren Davis we just talked about how much he's been contributing this season and he has gotten the opening goal for Drada and his first goal of the season John a great move across the face of the goal and a great finish again I presume it will be Aaron McNally but as you said it, it then it, it restricts them in their attacking substitutions then Dave yeah well here's McMullen down the right hand side he crosses it in and it's in the net it's 1-1 one, one. Oh, it's a great header Michael Duffy Michael Duffy what a header from him and it's no coincidence John that it happened when Evan Weir was off the pitch it was down that side drawn it down to 10 players and Derry City have equalised at a fine goal and we can't say it hasn't been coming right not the biggest squad in the world to start with and now two key players out here's Will Patching and he's going to have a goal from distance and he's he scored he has well we've been talking about it all game he's getting way too much room John and he was absolutely clinical there and Drada really should have been closing him down a bit more brilliant ball from Mark Connolly Mar plays it to him a short free kick Drada back off so they've got a lot of bodies behind the ball and it's unlike them back to Keeney again good ball forward towards Kaios down this right hand side Drada trying it build a little bit of pressure it's a good ball in towards the uh, centre of the penalty area it's Markey who gets onto it can they get a shot away Piero it's in Franz Piero with his first goal for the club you said it was going to come John and it has and what a finish very that's a quality finish and listen we said it that could be the thing that sparks his season now that is an absolutely quality Andrew finish Neil. Burns again showing his trickery he's very hard to dispossess Darrell Burns yeah, you can see now Fitzgerald doing a lot of his work in the final third to, to cover up for double up at Hutchinson. There's Burke, the shot from Burke! What a goal! And what a way to break your duck for this season on his 200th appearance. Graham Burke breaks the deadline. Continuing his good season. Here's Burke. Nugent is there. Referee plays a really good advantage, a chance for a second goal here, and it's in. It's 2-0. Aaron Green doubles Shamrock Rovers' advantage. Really excellent officiating by Kevin O'Sullivan, who might have blown for the free kick for the foul it's on Darren. Halfway, Darren Nugent is underneath it, and boom, the ball in behind for the run of Aaron Green. A great ball by Poom to Green. It makes it 3-0. What a finish. And surely that is game set and match. A wonderful goal from Shamrock Rovers. A brilliant pass from Poom. And a fantastic finish from Aaron Green for his second of the game. Rovers third. It's Shamrock Rovers three. It's like a Rovers nil. Their own stories. Two managers there. Deep in thought. On the sideline. There's a lot of Alcantonde here. And he's done well. The referee's given the penalty. Well, what was Cairns doing? Akintonde was going away from goal. Jordan Flores. Lovely penalty. Lovely penalty. Cairns guessed the right way, but it was into the bottom corner. He was never going to get that. Second goal of the season for Jordan Flores. And Bowles take the lead in the 37th minute. Oh, you're right, John. Top, top left. Rooney. Back post it goes. Oh, what a beautiful header that is. And it's Flores who snuck in at the back post. Nobody saw him. They could see him from up here, but Shells didn't see him. And he's thundered a header into the back of the net. Two, two goals, goals to net. It's just joined us. Ooh, keeper spilled it. Oh, there's a chance for Martin. Oh, keeper got up and did well. But Martin perhaps should have found the back of the net either side of the goalkeeper. And that's a penalty. <laughs> Down goes Tyreek Wilson. I thought there's about three penalty kicks in there, John, the last 15 <laughs> seconds, to be honest with you. Take your pick. It's John Martin. In the four goals so far this season. I'm on loan from Hull City. Can he make it five and get Chelsea back into this game? You know he can. Straight down the middle, that was composure. Keeper dive one way. Ball straight down the middle. Chelsea anxious to get the ball back and get on with the game.